Hello, welcome to Embedded World Nuremberg 2025. I am Franz Dugan, Director of Marketing, uh, Product Marketing uh, for Wireless IoT. Uh, covering Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, and ultra-wideband. So today I'm going to show you uh, two exciting demos uh, which are related to ranging technologies, so measuring distance between two devices. So the first one is ultra-wideband. So we have developed a full ultra-wideband solution uh, which provides a very accurate and secure way of measuring distance. So here we have an application running on this uh, Samsung uh, Galaxy smartphone. Um, so which is showing the distance between the phone and this uh, device, uh, which is the dongle of this laptop. And actually here we demonstrate uh, what is called uh, logical access, which is a FIRA 3.0 uh, application, uh, which is a kind of password replacement. So imagine that you are in front of your laptop and then someone is calling you, you walk away, and automatically, thanks to your laptop, as you move away, the laptop will automatically lock, so the application will lock, and if you go even further, the screen will actually lock. So that's one of the benefits of the target band, uh, to actually uh, measure accurately the distance with the peer device, and to use that as a secure element somehow, uh, in order to lock, unlock automatically your device. So that's one demo, and now I'm going to show uh, relatively similar things, but using Bluetooth channel sounding, so which is part of the Bluetooth 6.0, which is the latest version of the Bluetooth standard. So similarly here, you have a device which can behave as a door or a, a dongle for this laptop. And here we have the key, and we are similarly measuring the distance uh, between the door and the key. So the distance is shown here on this laptop, on the screen, so you can see in live uh, the distance which is measured between the two devices using the channel sounding technology. So you may ask here, yeah, what is the difference between UWB and Bluetooth channel sounding? Why using one or the other? Actually, the benefit of UWB is uh, the security. There is no equivalent on the market. It's highly secured and very accurate compared to Bluetooth channel sounding. So the benefit of Bluetooth channel sounding is that it's very uh, low cost, but with a bit lower uh, accuracy. So if you compare the two, uh, actually uh, with uh, the UWB you get 93, 96 centimeters, so it's very accurate at centimeter level, while uh, with Bluetooth channel sounding, uh, so we have something between 80 and uh, 90 centimeters. So relatively close to ultra wideband, but with lower accuracy uh, 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 and also lower level of security. But it can be good enough for many applications like asset tracking, etc. Uh, what we will find on the market is actually a combination of those two technologies in order to provide high accurate uh, and very secure uh, ranging uh, solution, for instance, for car access. So combined with channel sounding, which is actually low power. For more information about our ultra wideband and Bluetooth technology, so go to the SIVA website, so siva-ip.com.